There's a lot going on in our laboratories. Sometimes it's hard to keep on top of it all. And when you have your hands full, just making sure everything's running right, it can be easy to forget that you have to think about safety too. But safety is important, because if you're not careful, a laboratory can be a pretty dangerous place. We're all human, no matter how many years of school or work we have under our belts. And when things get hectic, we often suffer from an overwhelming urge to do the wrong thing, to take shortcuts and ignore safety precautions. So if you're new to your lab, while you're learning where the light switches are, you should also learn the safety rules. There's a wealth of safety information you should know. You need to learn about material safety data sheets, MSDSs, which describe a substance's ingredients, properties, and hazards. And there's your facility's chemical hygiene plan, which explains how to work with the chemicals in your lab safely. In fact, there are plans covering all types of hazards, including biologically infectious materials. You may read about things such as RICRA, lockout, tagout, and respiratory protection. You could also take courses on how to use fire extinguishers, perform first aid and CPR, and other important topics as well. But remember, the courses and written plans are only sources of information. You're the one who has to put the knowledge they give you to work. The ultimate responsibility to be safe lies with you. You should start by planning out your work carefully. Assemble all the materials and MSDSs you'll need ahead of time.